This will cover the manual setup process. Click the manual setup button to begin the process. You can name the actuator for ease of identification in the field. The motor operated valve tag will appear when you search for an actuator during the Bluetooth connection process. Set the state when the shaft extends. Here it closes when it extends. Here you set the maximum amount of thrust for the direction of travel. Choose if that thrust is to be used for opening and closing. This will apply a set thrust to the valve stem at the end of travel for a valve tight shut off. As opposed to limit that will stop the actuator at a set limit but without the tight shut off. You must ensure that the thrust, shaft action and end stop settings are correctly set or damage to the valve may occur. Select the start button to save changes and initiate the manual setup. To enable electrical operation, move the selector knob to the run position. The actuator may respond to any present remote control requests during loss of Bluetooth command or when navigating between screens. When the position control is operated for the first time, a warning will appear to indicate that the actuator will be taken offline and will respond to position control slider. Click on the OK button. When the output shaft is in the desired position, the travel limit can be set using the Set Open, Set Close buttons. Set Close Limit Use the position control slider to move the actuator output shaft to the required closed position. Click on the Set Close button to calibrate the close limit of travel. The set close and the serial number boxes are greyed out during the calibration procedure and indicate acceptance of the new settings when cleared. The new close limit position is now shown on the main scale indicator. Set open limit. Use the position control slider to move the actuator output shaft to the required open position. Click on the Set Open button to calibrate the open limit of travel. The Set Open and the serial number boxes are greyed out during the calibration procedure and indicate acceptance of the new settings when cleared. The new open limit position is now shown on the main scale indicator. The new limits of travel are shown on the green and red scales as inches millimeter position and percentages relative to the actuator's full mechanical stroke. The manual setup process is now complete.